Hello, today I'm going to teach you pronunciation, pronunciation of some words that generally people pronounce bad. Thank you for joining. My name is Daniel, and I'm sure you're going to have a wonderful moment together. Let's go now with the words. Anali avec moyo. Okay, we get the words on the board. For this word, people mispronounce it. People say woman because the singular is woman. For the singular, you say woman. When you're talking about one, you say woman. And for the plural, they mispronounce the plural. You don't say woman, you say women. Ou pa di woman, parce que l'en dégen singulier, mon nan di woman, eh bien, ça vient de faire que l'en la prononce pluriel là, li di même woman. C'est pas même bagay, c'est pas même prononciation, all right? You say women. For the singular, you say woman, and for the plural, you say women. We, 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 we. Women, okay, women. For example, one woman, two women, okay, good. Can you pronounce after me? You say women, great, women, sounds good. Let's go for the second word. The second word is a or o. You can say often and you can say often also. The t. The letter T can be silent or you can pronounce it. It's not a problem. For American English, they don't pronounce the letter T. For British English, they pronounce the T. For American English, they say often, okay, or often. And for British English, they say often, okay? You say often for American English or often for British English. Good. And for this word, you say onion, 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 onion. You can put onion in the sauce. Onion, you say onion. Okay, good. Onion, onion, onion. Good. You pronounce that, you say onion. Very good. And what about this word? This word, people might pronounce it bad but in english it is pronounced as you say lettuce 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 i'm sure you listen to me now you have to repeat after me so that you can um be able to pronounce it quite well you say lettuce 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 is a vegetable lettuce not lettuce, do not say lettuce, I eat lettuce, I need lettuce in my salad. You don't say that, you say I need lettuce. Do you have lettuce? This is the way you should pronounce this word. You say lettuce. Very good. And now let's go to the next vocabulary. The next vocabulary is the place where you can go with a friend or uh, a member of your family or your family. It's hotel hotel and sometimes people say hotel no it's hotel because the stress is on the second syllable stress ali na deuxième syllable là c'est ça qui fait moi dire hotel body hotel and the h is stress the h you say you don't say hotel you say hotel because you have to pronounce the h the letter h is pronounced so let us ali prononcer ou dit Hotel. Upadzi hotel. Udi hotel. I'm going to the hotel. Hotel. You stress the second syllable. All right. You say hotel. Very good. And what about this word? This word might be hard to pronounce. Mosaigen wa du pou pronounce. Why? Because you don't pronounce the th here. This th that you have is silent. You say asthma. You don't say as smart. It's hard to say. You cannot say it like this. You simply say asthma. You don't pronounce this th sound. You don't try the th sound. You don't try to pronounce this th sound that you have here. You drop it. Okay? You say asthma. Asthma, okay? Asthma, asthma, asthma. That's great, sounds good. And next vocabulary is sour, 
sour. Sour. If something is not sweet, it can be bitter or sour. Si on bagay pas sweet, ça veut dire douce. Li kapab bitter, ki signifi amer. Bitter, bitter, bitter. Li kapab bitter, it can be bitter or sour. Ou bien li sur. Like lemon. Lemon is sour. Lemon sur. Ça veut dire citron sur. Okay, you say sour. 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 Very good. Do you hear very well? Now, let's go to the next vocabulary. And the next vocabulary, you say debt. 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 It's like this. You got a debt. Debt. What do you say debt and you have a letter B here? You don't pronounce this letter B. This letter B is silent. Ou pas prononcer lettre B a parce que le silence. You don't say debt. You say debt. For example, I can say, you got a debt for me. You got a debt. Debt. Okay, ou gon debt pour moi, ou gon debt envers moi-même. You say debt. The debt. Lor pale de debt. You don't pronounce B, you say debt. Very simple. Debt. Debt. Okay, I got a debt. I remember that. I got a debt for you. Mwen gen on debt pour ou même. Okay, mwen gon debt envers ou même. Okay, very good. Let's go now to next vocabulary. The next vocabulary word is restaurant. 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 Resto. Ta. Ta. Rant. Here you don't say rent, you say rant. Some people say rent. I'm going to the restaurant. It's not correct to say I'm going to the restaurant because here you got want. It's not rent. You say rant. I'm going to the restaurant. Are you going to the restaurant? Est-ce que vous dans le restaurant? Yes, I'm going to the restaurant. I'm going to the restaurant. We have to go to the restaurant tonight. Nous devons aller dans le restaurant ce soir. Yeah. Good. You say restaurant, you don't say restaurant. Very good. And the stress is on the first syllable. Et puis stress là, il est dans le premier syllable. Accent, dans le premier syllable. You say restaurant. 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 I'm going to the restaurant. Good. And next word is very important and it's common. People usually pronounce it how they want. Some of, some of them pronounce this word how they want or they mispronounce it because they get confused because of the verb. The verb is to break. When you say to break, for example, I have this marker and I break it. I break it in two pieces. For example, when I mark it, I'm going to cut it in two pieces. The verb is to break. Verb that is break, which means to cut, cut, break, etc. To break. Par contre, when I say this, I'm not saying break. I'm saying breakfast. Breakfast. I don't say break. I say break. Break. Ek. Break. Breakfast. Breakfast. I have to eat breakfast. I'm hungry. I have to eat breakfast. You say breakfast. 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 Okay, do you eat breakfast today? Yes, I eat breakfast. Breakfast. Good. And about this word. For this word, the problem, some people pronounce all the syllables that they see in this word. No. Let me show you. You don't say vegetable because you don't pronounce this syllable. Ou pas prononce syllabe ça, ou pas dire vegetable. You say veg, veg, veg. You don't pronounce this syllable. You say vegetable, 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 vegetable. Okay, good. Vegetable. I like vegetable. Do you like vegetable? I think you like vegetable. Me, I don't like vegetable. Somebody else can say, I don't like vegetable. And me, I can say, I like vegetable. You pronounce it as vegetable. Vegetable. That's great. Let's go now to this word. This word is really important to know how to pronounce it because if you pronounce this word bad, that can drive you to pronounce other words, okay? Other words, bad. I'm going to explain when I say other words. Let's go for this word. You say for noun. For noun. The stress is on the first syllable. You say for noun. And about this, do you know why I put two before? It's because I want to attract your attention on this. 
And I want to show you that I have a verb here. This is a noun. Ça c'est un nom. Flip un adjectif, flip un verb. This is a noun. It's not an adjective. It's not a verb. It's a noun. This word, pronoun. It's a noun. And this is a verb. You pronounce it. Pronouns. Pronouns. The stress is in the second syllable. And the stress is in the first syllable for this. And when you want to say the verb, et l'ovle dit verbe là qui signifie prononcer le verbe, the verb, you say pronouns. And the stress is in the second syllable. I say pronouns, 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 pronouns. And when I'm talking about this, I say pronoun, pronoun. Pronouns are not the same because in this, the stress is in the first syllable and in this, the stress is in the second syllable and they are not the same. You pas même mot. Stress la la dans premier syllable là, ou di pronoun qui signifie pronom, pronom personnel sujet, pronom complément, etc. And the stress in this word is in the second syllable. Accent sur deuxième syllable là dans mot ça qui sont verb, which is a verb. Okay? Qui c'est un verbe. Il signifie prononcer le verbe. I say pronounce. Do you want to pronounce for me the word? Who wants to pronounce the word? Okay? You say pronounce. Pronounce. And remember, at the end of this word, you listen to the sound s. Pronounce. Pronounce. You listen to s sound. And in this word, when you say pronoun, the singular, for the plural, you listen to z sound. You say pronouns. One, two, three, four pronouns. Pronouns. I think you understand. Moi, dis que, n'en fait mot ça, autant de son s, leur prononcer, leur dit pronouns. Pronouns. C'est son s, c, e, a, b, i. Mais l'em n'en mot ça, moi, prononcer pluriel là, s, ça, qui n'en pluriel là, prononcer comme z. Moi, dis, Pronouns. Pronouns. Okay? Good. And this word also gives trouble to people because they say if the verb is to pronounce, the noun must be pronunciation. C'est ça, pile moun di. En pile moun, nan mo sa, yo di si le verb se pronounce, le verb prononce se pronounce, eh bien, le nom ki se pronunciation supposé prononce comme Pronunciation. Eh bien, c'est ça qui fait grand pile moun qui souvent dit pronunciation. Par contre, moi, pas écrit pronunciation. Ok? For this word, you say pronunciation. You have a good pronunciation. Pro, pro, pro. Pronunciation. Pro, pro. Pronunciation. Siation. You got a good pronunciation. Nunciation. Nunciation, pronunciation, pronunciation, pronunciation. You have good pronunciation. Yeah, you love my pronunciation. All right, good. Pronunciation, pronunciation. Now you say pronoun, pronouns, pronoun, pronouns. For the verb, you say pronouns to pronounce. And for the noun, you say pronunciation. This is also a noun. Ça son nom tout, qui signifie pronom. Mais ça son nom directement là m'a parlé de prononcer et bien moi je ne nom qui c'est prononciation. Ça son nom et ça son verbe. Very good. And about this word. This word is mispronounced also. Why? It's because some people pronounce the letter P that you see in it. You don't say we seeped. No. You have to drop this letter. This letter is silent. You say receipt. And also the stress is in the second syllable. You don't say receipt. You say receipt. 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 Can you show me your receipt? Yeah, I can show you my receipt. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Do, do you get a receipt? Yes, I have a receipt. Receipt. 
You don't say I have a receipt. You say a receipt. I got a receipt. You say receipt. You don't say receipt. You say receipt. And you don't pronounce letter P. Receipt. 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 Very good. And for this word, you say mortgage. 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 If you say mortgage, it's not okay because here you don't say age. You say edge. Edge. You say mortgage. Mortgage. And mortgage means the loan given by the bank to buy a house. Mortgage. C'est prêt banque l'enfer pour acheter un cai. You say mortgage. All right, good. For this word, moi ça by problème. Il fait un pile monde dans confusion. But you say close. 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 C'est comme ça on prononce elle. Close. Close. C'est comme ça on prononce elle. But you can say, you can try to pronounce the th. And here you got the voice th. Ou ka pa pa pese prononce th voisé. The voice th. And when you say close, close. Okay? But it's close. Close. Like when you close a door. C'est comme si même genre dit close qui signifie fermer. Close. Only you say o. Oh, close. Close. Okay? Close. What you wear. What you put on you. C'est ça mettre à qui signifie vêtement. Close. And about this word. This word is sword. Sword. Of course, it's sword. Why do I pronounce it as sword? It's because this letter is it pronounced. I don't pronounce W. Moi pas prononcer W. Moi pas dit sword. Moi dit sword. Parce que W a silence. Sword. You know, this is an arm you can use to fight. A sword. You see the picture of the sword. Very good. And these words, I think. This is the last, the last rank. C'est dernier rangé que nous là. For this word, people pronounce this word bad. Why? Because they try to pronounce this letter. However, this letter is silent. Par contre, let ça silence. H là pas prononcé. Ou dit vehicle. E, E, vehicle, vehicle. You don't say vehicle, you say vehicle, or you try to say vehicle. No, it's not like this. You simply say vehicle. Where is the vehicle? Côté véhicule. Where is the vehicle? Vehicle. 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 It's very simple. Vehicle. And this letter is silent. You don't pronounce the letter H. Vehicle. Good. And this, for this word, some people pronounce it bad also. And pour moi ça tout, quand pile moun ki prononce le mal, some people say etc. Okay? And you pronounce it as etc. etc. The stress is in the second syllable. You say etc. 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 You say this word or this word or this word etc. Okay? etc. 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 Can you try to pronounce it? etc. Good. And for this word, people pronounce all the syllables that they see in this word. And this is why it's mispronounced. Raison qui fait li pa bien prononcer en pile fois, c'est parce que mon yo prononcer toutes syllabes qui la donne. And ou pa dwe prononcer toutes syllabes. I'm going to show you why. It's because this syllable is it pronounced. C'est parce que syllabe ça pas prononcé. You don't say interesting. Interesting. No. You just pronounce T with this syllable. You say intre. And when you have T, T and R, when T combines with R, it gives you, it sounds like ch. The same way when you say try, I try, it's because T combines with R, with letter R. You say ch plus Y, you have try. And the same thing for intre, intre, 
S interest thing. It's very interesting. Instead of saying it's very interesting, you don't pronounce it well, unfortunately. You have to say instead, interesting. 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 Ça prononce comme interesting. For example, it's interesting to watch English videos. It's interesting to watch English videos. And the last, no, before the last. And you say, why? Because the only one. I got something else. Some people say, says. They say, the way it is, okay, the way they see it. No, it's not says, it's says. It's the third person of singular, the verb to say. C'est troisième personne du singulier du verbe say, qui, qui c'est verbe dire. Lorsque la la troisième personne lui prend s, ou pas dit says, de préférence, by the way, you pronounce it as says. Ou prononcez le même genre, le m'a dit says en créole. 15 says, le m'a pointé en créole. Il prononce comme says. You pronounce it as says. He says to me, or she says to me. For example, do you listen to what he says? Do you listen to what he says? Do you listen to what she says? Est-ce que vous entendez ça dit? Do you listen to what he says? Ah, vous entendez ça l'abdi, ça lui dit ah? Ah, what he says, what she says. And when you have the past of the verb to say, some people say said. No, it's not said. It's said. We say said. You say says and you say said. Lite di moi, he said to me. Mademoiselle la di moi, he says to me. All right? Present and then past. For the present you say says and for the past you say said. You said to me blah blah blah. Ou te dim blah blah blah. Yesterday you said to me you are okay. Yeah, ou te dim ke ou ok. And today, Janine dim ke ou pa ok. And today, Janine says to me that you are not ok. Janine dim ke ou pa ok. Do you understand? You say says, you say said. Not said, not says. Says, said. Very good. A last time, can you pronounce after me? They say women. You say often, they say onion, lettuce, hotel, asthma, sour, sour, and you say debt, you don't say debt, you say debt, restaurant, restaurant, Breakfast, vegetable, said, pronoun, pronouns, to pronounce, pronunciation, receipt, mortgage, mortgage, close, sword, Sword, vehicle, vehicle, etc., etc. Interesting, interesting, says. Let's go now. A bit faster. On t'y caspi rapide. Women, often, onion, lettuce. Hotel, asthma, sour, debt, restaurant, breakfast, vegetable, said, pronoun, pronouns, to pronounce, pronunciation, pronunciation, we see. Mortgage, clothes, sword, vehicle, 
etc. etc. Interesting. Interesting. Says. Says. All right, thank you for making your time to watch this video, especially you who watched the video till the end. Tell me what you learned in this video. Dim qui sont apprendre dans vidéo ça, qui mo ko pa prononcer bien que ou apprendre prononcer dans vidéo ça. Commentez pour dim ça et dim qui côté ou regarder nous. Partagez vidéo ça avec zanmi ou, like li et puis commentez pour qui ton petit mot pour nous pour dire nous sur un contenu, soit apprendre bagage de nouveau et qui côté ou suivre. My name is Daniel and I'm working for you. I love you so much. Catch you in a more interesting video. Bye for now.